Well, dear friend, as you can see, I'm in an elevator. It seems that I'm just a pro uh, get out of my dormitory, actually. Uh, it is, but uh, I didn't, you know, stay spend all my afternoon in the dormitory. I spent all time in the library, but just now, I checked about the weather report. It says it could be decreased to three or four centigrades at late night, which is exactly uh, when I would get back to the dormitory. So I think, and I drink some iced tea in the library, which makes me feel really jelly and freezing. Uh, and I decide to get back to the dormitory, change my change my coat. I will, uh, you know, light coats this afternoon when I get out of the dormitory to eat my lunch. But it's really a little cold, so I change this heavy coat uh, instead of the light one. And uh, now I'm now I'm at the laundry room to do my laundry. I mean, put my oh, put my uh, stuff my sports clothes, sorry, uh, into the dry machine. All right, I'm fine. Sorry. All right. Here. We are leaving the dormitory. This is the uh, way which I regularly I won't go because this is the way to the parking lot I don't have a car here so I usually I don't go this way look at can you see let me check about can you see that I mean do you see the pinky color I don't know but uh, from the side of my eyes they are so beautiful you know the sun Sunrise, sun, sunshine is the, best, the most beautiful things in this world. All right. Um, actually, uh, today um, I just want to talk about something. My opinions about the uh, grocery stores. You know, uh, there's not there. There are. Uh, it's pretty convenient for us because this year there are two new open the. New open uh, grocery stores, which is very close to our school, probably about uh, five minutes of walking. One of them is the Publix, and the other is the Walmart. Uh, uh, to be honest, I uh, I haven't been to the Publix for probably about one week because, you know, uh, uh, to be frank, the price of the products in the Publix. It's a little bit higher than the normal price. They are a little ex more expensive than the uh, reasonable price. I don't know why. Probably because they serve good quality. Uh, the their products are really good. I mean the quality, and uh, they get, they they have a lot of fresh meat, fresh vegetables. All the things inside of the Publix are fresh. They, are, they have their own bakery house. They make donuts themselves, and I tasted their donuts. Well, well, the first donuts I tasted in America is not Krispy Kreme. It's not my favorite Dunkin' Donuts. It's the donuts in the Publix. I tried them. Uh, it's one of them is the long joints. It's uh, chocolate icing. Uh, you know. Uh, bread, uh, some kind of donuts, and it has a lot of Boston cream inside of it. It's awesome, and also some cinnamon bun, something like that. And they have great quality in their bread. They are fresh baked, and they throw away uh, all the things which may be expired. And you know, at, uh, they close at 11. And what if uh, I usually, you know, I'm a late night animal like a vampire well i like to go outside or do some activities at late night so usually i would go to the publix at about uh 10 30 pm and that is they close at 11 30 every day so 
I will always see the you know the people in the public throw away some some meat, some chicken, some fresh vegetables. Actually, they they can be eat. I you know they are just you know there's not not a big difference between those food approaching to their data of experience but uh, I don't know if I am the person if they give me that food I will eat definitely because they are not bad they just are not as fresh as um, you know brand new but they still can be eat they are not bad right they didn't go wrong there are no strength flavor inside of it they can still be good but maybe it's not as fresh as uh, not as fresh as perfect well back to the topic i'm still uh today uh usually i would buy the meat and the fresh vegetables in the publics but recently i really don't have interest of cooking myself because uh i live alone i mean i have roommates but uh we're not family members uh i i i won't have the responsibility or interest to cook dinner for my roommate right uh, and I since I live alone I really don't have interest to you no know, do a lot of stuff but back in China I mean in my home uh, when uh, when I I was uh, you know in a college and that college is in the Nanjing which is a very big city it's probably 30 uh, one hour of driving from my home to to the city which I have uh, I my college is in so I want to go home every day but I would probably go home twice a week tw uh, uh, twice a month it means every other week so uh, whenever I get home my mom would have a rest have a break because my mom has a very busy work he's uh, uh, you know how to say that he's the guarantee or supervisor of a hospital's nurse I mean uh, uh, she, I'm, I'm sorry. You know, sometimes you would get a letter strand that seems every Chinese will mix the she or he whenever they say. I want to tell you that in Chinese, when you speak Chinese, uh, he or she means different uh, uh, person with different gender, right? But in Chinese, he or she has the same pronunciation, but with different characteristics. Uh, they have same pronunciation. We we say it. We say she or he, ta. It's both the same, but uh, writes different. But uh, when you say that, the tone is the same. So that is why I always count, you know, distinguish when I speak uh, very quickly, uh, because you know, it comes constantly in my mind. Won't have uh, you know. Uh, unconscious uh, benefit to distinguish them when I want to say it because in Chinese they both the same all right back to the topic can you see that that is the public can you see the logo with with the green 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 light that is the public uh, today uh, I usually would buy the meats and fresh vegetables in the public since I don't have interest don't have the enthusiasm to cook recently I don't go to that place because I don't need the fresh products um, I only buy some fat free chips some energy drinks so I would go to the Walmart which has a much more reasonable price well in Knoxville I have been to many uh, well these two are the closer the closest uh, grocery store which approached my uh, from my uh, dormitory so I went to that place as much as possible there yeah, it's convenient for me to walk I don't have a car and uh, but I have a sister here uh, well actually it's not my sister you know in China uh, you can call whatever the people but you have you need to have deep close relationship uh, that kind of friends who is older or younger than you you can call this sister or brother uh, so my sister but with we have close relationship but without any blood relationship um, she would, she picked me up to some you know uh, uh, 
some other grocery stores. One of them is Costco. It have large amount of products. I mean, the products uh, with large amount of. If you have a family, uh, maybe you have eleven or twelve sister or brothers. That huge family probably Costco. Uh, Costco is the best place for them to go. Um, uh, and I also went been to the Earth Fair. It seems it's a local grocery store here in the Tennessee, Knoxville. It only have shops in the Knoxville, Nashville, and uh, and uh, probably only in Tennessee. Probably Earth Fair. Their their cakes are great. Their pineapple chocolate cakes are great. And um, I also been to the. Uh, which I also been to. Let me see. Uh, I still remember. Oh, it is a Chinese market. It sells a lot of products, you know, uh, from Chinese. Uh, our special food, some dumplings, meat, uh, rice cook, rice cakes, something like that. Uh, also, there is another grocery store. I don't remember exactly. It's probably the. Let me see. Well, let it be. I don't remember, but I'm sure there's another grocery store I have been to. But uh, you know, among all of these grocery stores, I think Walmart has uh, most reasonable price. I mean, it is a regular and very common. The price is not too high or too low. It's very reasonable and be can be acceptable. But they're not as cheap as you can expect. I mean. They are not very the cheapest, but they are very reasonable in Walmart. But the Publix, they are not reasonable because the same product. I mean the chips, something like that, chips, uh, rice cookies, uh, something very usual snacks. They sell much more expensive than Walmart. I don't know why, but today I'm not going to buy the meat or vegetables. Either, but I'm still going to the public. Do you know why? Because Max Trillion just uploaded his video yesterday. Uh, he said there's a new flavor of uh, monster drinks, which is my favorite. You know, I love orange soda. I love orange soda so much. Here you see this uh, chicken breast. They're pretty fresh. Maybe I will buy them when I have interest to cook. And they have great quality of the cakes, different cakes. But I'm not going to eat cake tonight. Um, their bread are, are awesome, I tell you. A lot of bread. And here is the donuts. Well, apple fritter. Can you see that? Apple fritter? This is apple fritter and the glazed or cinnamon. I don't know. Apple fritter is definitely my favorite. I think I have two favorite donuts. One is apple fritter, the other is Boston cream. But if you tell me that I can only have one donut, I would definitely choose apple fritter. Apple fritter is always my favorite donut. Awesome. All right. Uh, I usually, when I eat and um, well, go to buy some bread, I prefer their Victor's, the French sticks. They are letter chewy. They are the bread I usually eat. I also like their, you know, the onion buns. When I want to make some hamburgers myself, I would buy the onion buns. Uh, they also have a lot of, you see, a lot of uh, fresh. Uh, their fried chicken are awesome. The sandwich are also awesome. But I'm not going to eat that today. How about I go to grab some? Salad? I don't know. Mac and cheese, fried chicken. The sandwich are huge and are very heavy, but I think probably the bread is too huge. Uh, I don't want to eat too many carbs today. They also have great, you know, see, fresh vegetables there. Uh, I want to say what? Oh, the cheese. The cheese. They have holy ton of cheese here and. Uh, what I'm go trying to say is, uh, oh, I've got something I want to say. Uh, I can't remember. Sorry. 
Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> not, not at all. We have a lot to... Oh, fire one. Party squirrels. Mmm, great. See? See? Well, I was uh, affected by the Mac Truni uh, a lot. It's because, you know, Americans' food is uh, a little bit different from the what I eat in China. So when I settle down here, I want to learn some, you know, knowledge and information from the locals here. And uh, he is so great and he has a lot of, you know, I, I like him very much. So I respect him. I. I would follow his steps just like the letter map, ship. Um, oh, this is a new, I think. Cheerios usually don't have the fruit flavor. I don't know. Uh, I haven't, uh, you know, I bought a chocolate Lucky Charm and also the, also the peanut butter crunch captain, the captain. And also, I think I'm, uh, yeah, I bet the tricks. I haven't finished them yet in the dormitory, so probably this week I'm not going to buy some cereal, but I will definitely buy it uh, after I finish the three whole box, huge family size of box of cereal at my uh, at my dormitory. I I want to try them all, try different flavor. I don't know. I I'm a little interested in this Frosted Flakes chocolate one, uh, and also probably I will buy that next time. And also, and also, I don't know. This cinnamon, probably. Oh, they can buy one for get a, another one for free, which means you can buy it uh, in the half price. All right, uh, uh, cereal is not today's topic. Today's topic is monster drink, monster drink, monster drink. I just want to check about whether there's. The new flavor of monster drinks here. Uh, if there's no new flavor, I will probably still go to the Walmart to get my usual style. All right, uh, probably there's. I can't find them. Just a little minute. Yeah, it's here. It's a lot of people here. Oh, here. Let's see. It seems there's no, there's no new flavor. It has orange flavor, but I can't see them. It has 10 calories. I'm not going to drink that. How about this? Oh, damn. It seems this is a uh, orange one and it only have 10 calories each. Should I buy this? Try something flavor? No, I'm not going to buy this. You know why? Because I just want to try something I really like. There's no orange flavor. Okay, let's. It seems. Uh, all right, probably will. I'm going to get to the Walmart because there's no, no things that interest me. All right, uh, see you guys when I get food, probably in the library.